look at how to embed a, a Google slide presentation. Uh, this presentation here is one that uh, I've worked on with a prior class. First thing we want to do is we want to double check our sharing settings. So we go up here to share and you'll see that we've got anyone with a link can view and that's where we want to be because we don't want people coming to our blog and and then editing your presentation. Okay. Uh, you'll notice here that uh, we will be sharing them with our classmates so we can actually invite people in and I'm going to ask you to invite each other so that you can comment on each other's work and invite me but that's kind of another level so so these invited people can edit but the general public cannot okay so we've got our sharing settings done so now we're going to go up here to file <clears throat> and we're going to go to publish to the web and we get uh, this kind of dialog box here. It says it can uh, auto advance every three seconds, so forth and so on. Restart slideshow at the end of the last slide. What we want to do is we want to click on the embed setting because this is just a hyperlink, but we actually want to embed it. So we're going to click here and it gives us some sizes that actually this, this is too small and this is too big. So the 480 is too small. The 960 is kind of large. So let's type in custom here, and we're just going to change 960 to 640, 640. And that automatically changes the height so that it stays in the correct aspect ratio. And you'll see here that there's an embed code. So I'm going to do a control copy or control C. Um, and now I've got that on my clipboard. Uh, over at our blog, I'm logged in as kind of the student version of me. Uh, we're going to create an HTML snippet. Uh, notice it defaults to my, these are my student snit, snippets. Uh, if I go to all snippets, you'll see we see everybody's. And this is what I see when I'm logged in as the administrator. And it's much easier for me to manage things in the future if you include a name like we've done on some of these along with like Hicks my map okay I know exactly what that is so I'm gonna go add new um, and I'm gonna entitle this uh, Pappas slides like this and then I've got that I've got this code on my clipboard uh, and I'm gonna paste it in okay uh, and then I'm gonna publish it and what I'm going to end up with is a um, is an embed code, which is right down here. So I'm going to get this entire embed code, including the brackets, and do a command or control C and copy it in onto my clipboard. Then I'm going to go over here and start a new post. And uh, we're just going to call this slides for now. Uh, I'm going to put a little text in space down a little put a little more text in because I want to work around this in bed later and I want to be sure that I don't accidentally delete it um, so uh, notice I'm on the visual side not in the HTML editor uh, because this uh, these these snippets work here and I'm going to do a control paste a control V I'm going to save the draft and uh, then we'll just take a look at it under preview and you'll see when I preview it it goes to get that code and it loads up and so this is a presentation that you can actually run through here you can put it in autoplay and so forth and so on okay so have fun with that